So what exactly is a custom GPT, and why would anyone want one? Think of it as having a super smart robot friend that specializes in your favorite topic, whether it's baking cookies, learning a language, or in our case, it's algorithmic trading. In this section, we'll break down what a custom GPT is. Imagine the standard GPT as a generalist. It can chat about almost anything, but maybe you want your GPT to be a specialist like an expert in algorithmic trading who knows everything about stock market strategies and trading algorithms. That's where a custom GPT comes in. You train it on specific data, so it becomes an expert in a niche topic. All right, before we dive into creating our custom GPT, we need to set up our environment. One important note, you'll need a premium ChatGPT subscription that is ChatGPT Plus from OpenAI to follow along. Once you have that, head over to the ChatGPT and if you don't, then just watch this video. Do you want a chat GPT plus for this course? Is it required? The answer is no. I will be using a custom GPT in this course, so I don't want that you guys wonder what it is or how can I get it. That's exactly why I am making this video, so you guys can be aware of it. Anyway, let's come back to the topic. So when you arrive on this page, you'll see the familiar chat GPT interface, but we won't be using that directly. Instead, look over to the right-hand top profile icon. Click on it, and look for the option that says My GPTs. Click on it, and let's dive in. Now that we're in the Explore GPTs section, let's take a look at some examples. Here, you'll see a variety of custom GPTs created by me. For instance, there's one called Finance Script, trained on financial knowledge for high-quality responses. Another is Script Paraphraser, perfect for paraphrasing any texts. And here's Algo Trade Architect, which codes trading bots for me based on the data I provide. Each custom GPT focuses on a specific task to deliver more accurate results. This gives you a sense of what's possible with your own custom GPT. Time to roll up our sleeves and create our custom GPT. Click on the Create button in the top. This opens an interface with two options, Create and Configure. The Create option lets you build your GPT through a conversational interface, while Configure allows you to manually fill in details. You can start with one and tweak the other as needed. For now, let's click on Create to begin our journey. You'll be greeted with a conversational interface. It's like having a chat with a helpful assistant you'll see some initial instructions and examples of prompts you can use. Let's start by typing in a prompt, like, I want to make a new GPT that helps people with algorithmic trading. Once you send that, the GPT Builder will guide you through the process. It might suggest names and ask if the profile picture is good with me or not. I'll just say yes for now. Now let's see how we can give more instructions to customize this personal GPT. Let's add some personality to our GPT. Define the tone and tasks for your GPT. For example, you might want it to be professional, analytical, and focused on trading strategies. You can also specify things to avoid, ensuring it stays on topic. I will write, please change the starters to create a Binance trading bot. It will take a few seconds, and then we will be able to see the changes. With our initial setup done, it's time to fine tune and test our GPT. Click on the configure tab to see all the settings. Here, you can adjust the profile, description, and instructions. If the response isn't quite right, you can tweak the instructions and try again. Remember, this is an iterative process. Adjust until you're satisfied. For those wanting to take it a step further, you can enable advanced features like web browsing and image generation. This allows your GPT to pull information from the internet or create images on the fly. You can also integrate APIs for additional functionality, such as fetching real-time stock data or executing trades. Imagine the possibilities. 
your GPT can become a truly powerful assistant. Once you're happy with your custom GPT, it's time to publish it. Click on Create in the top right corner and choose who can access your GPT. You can keep it private, share it with a link, or publish it to the GPT store for others to use. Remember, only those with a ChatGPT subscription can interact with it. Hit Share, and you're all set. Think about the practical applications of your custom GPT. Whether you're a trader using it for market analysis, a financial advisor creating strategies, or someone looking to automate trading tasks, the possibilities are endless. As you continue to interact with and refine your GPT, you'll find it becomes more and more useful. Congratulations! You've now learned how to create your very own custom GPT. The process involves exploring existing models, building and customizing your own, fine-tuning it, and finally, publishing it. If you create a custom GPT, let me know in the discussion section on what it does. In the next video, I will go through the Algo Trade Architect that I have built for this course, and I will be using it. We will explore further in the next video. See you there.